Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, it's me Faith. So for today's video I wanted to talk about my favorite clothing pieces. So in my room I have a clothing rack and on it I keep like my favorite pieces ever. So I thought it would be a cool video to go through them, talk about my favorite pieces. I obviously love clothes and fashion so much, it's such a huge part of my life that I wanted to share just like the sentimental meanings behind all my pieces. Um, some of them don't have sentimental meanings. These are like the pieces that I'll always have keep them for my future children. Let's just get right into it. Start with like, on these ends I have some purses. The first purse is um, this Marc Jacobs tote bag. I bought this this Christmas. It's sentimental to me because it's like the first designer bag I'm pretty sure that I bought myself and I actually really love it. And this green color is like my favorite. It's special to me because I bought it myself. On this side we have this black mini bag, it's just one of my favorites. I use it almost every single day. It's just, it's actually very spacious. Like it looks tiny, but you can fit a lot of stuff in it. And it reminds me of like the Prada bags. And I love it, it's by Gap, thrifted it. And then this bag is my, my favorite purse ever. Um, this is the Marc Jacobs Heaven like mini bag. I got this as a present for my birthday one year and it's just my favorite for a lot of different reasons it's my favorite color and it's just such a cute bag i just love mark jacobs heaven pieces this is very special to me because i wanted this so bad and like i never thought that i would get it and then i just got gifted it so this is definitely one of my favorites kind of like my bags that are on my clothing rack okay so this top is definitely one of my prized possessions it's this like zodiac mesh top it's so beautiful it's by this really cool brand whirl i got this on depop a few months ago and i don't know it's just one of my favorite pieces i feel like if i designed clothes i would definitely do something with mesh and like zodiac stuff it's also a super flattering fit i don't know it's just one of those pieces that like i just think is so beautiful and one of a kind and just like so me and I just love it so much. I'll treasure this top forever. This t-shirt I thrifted and it says I heart men and then it's X'd out me. I just love this shirt. I think it's so funny. I think it's so cute. It's also like the perfect kind of vintage tee. This is from 2004 so I guess it's not really vintage but it is just a perfect t-shirt. I thrifted it and it's just one of those pieces that like are just so funny to me. I think this is just very silly. I love it. I talk about these jeans all the time um, but these are truly one of my favorite pieces that I own and best thrift finds. Um, it's these dollhouse butterfly jeans. I actually, like every time I wear them in a TikTok or anything, like a lot of people ask me where they're from. They're from this brand dollhouse. And it's funny because I obviously found these at the Salvation Army. I obviously thought they were super cute, but I didn't realize how like rare or like valuable they are. I don't know. Um, but they fit me so nicely. They're just so gorgeous. Like. They're low-waisted and the like waist has this like super amazing butterfly design. The wash is so cool and they're super flattering as well. Like I love the back, how it has absolutely no pockets. This is just like a prized possession of mine. I will never sell these just because I love them so much and like I can't wait to have children someday so like I can pass these on. But yeah, they're by the brand dollhouse. This top, this was the first, I think, I think, honestly I have a horrible memory, but this is a Marc Jacobs Heaven baby tee. This is, I, I'm pretty sure the first piece that I personally purchased myself on the Marc Jacobs Heaven site, so that's kind of why it's like a prized possession or like a sentimental piece because I love the Marc Jacobs Heaven line. Like one of my like biggest dreams, goals is to like model for them or like work at the store to like do something with them so this piece is like the first piece that i bought uh this was last summer i think and it's those like the little bear i think it's called the bear trap tea and i just really love it it just means a lot to me 
This one is from the Rat Girl collaboration. This is also one of my favorites, but this one was like my very first piece from them that I bought and I love it. This shirt is sentimental to me because my grandmother gave this to me. This was hers when she was like, not my age, like maybe a little older, but I just like, it's just like a true, true like vintage piece. It's down to me, which is like very special to me, obviously. It's just this very sparkly black top. She gave this to me and it's like, definitely my style like if i saw this at the thrift store i would definitely buy it okay this next piece is a corset that i thrifted it's just so beautiful there's so many like design like details like the beads and like the embroidery on it i love like clothes that have beads on them i think that's like the cutest touch ever so this is just definitely like one of my best thrift finds and it's just like a beautiful piece in my opinion it like laces up in the front has like the beads on the bottom it's just gorgeous i love corsets and like it's very rare that i find corsets that like fit me also something just so beautiful that i thrifted so these are my favorite jeans i reach for these so much they're like my comfort pair of pants i love the fit of them they're so comfortable they're so flattering um, so they're by the Gap. They have this tag and they're just Gap classic jeans. These are in a size 10 regular. They're just like literally plain blue wash jeans. I cut them so they weren't too long on me, but these are my favorite jeans in the whole world. I wear these constantly and they are just the best. They're just flattering and comfortable and just perfect in every single way. So I've actually thrifted like designer pieces, I guess. Not sure if they're authentic or not, but um, they're definitely one of my favorite pieces I've ever found. This one is a Moschino, I think that's how you pronounce it, sweater. I've actually talked about this multiple times on my channel, but um, yeah, I love this. It's actually like one of my favorite, not just because it's Moschino or Moschino, because it's so cool. It's like very futuristic. It's very good quality, it's thick. And it's just one of my favorite pieces ever. I'll always have this piece. It's definitely one of the best thrift finds I've ever had. And then also I've thrifted a Dolce & Gabbana top. This is a junior's top, but it does fit me. Um, it just is so cute. It says magical on it and it has like stripes on the side. It's this green color. It's just very, my style you know what i mean i love these colors and it's a very flattering fit then most recently i thrifted this vivian westwood button down definitely one of the craziest finds also i've ever found it was just randomly in the boy section and i don't know i just i'm it's like cool i think clothes is so cool especially thrifting because like some people like probably the people that worked there like didn't realize what vivian westwood was or it was like a designer I guess and they just you know someone's trash is another person's treasure I guess so I thrifted this Jean-Paul Gaultier Gaultier top also one of my fucking favorite shirts ever it's this really stretchy material so it's super flattering on um this is also a junior's top it's just this like kind of like graffiti print I absolutely adore this so much and it's like one of my favorite designers so that's obviously a favorite. I showed you guys this in a vlog, but for my birthday this year, I bought myself this mesh top. Once again, mesh astrology zodiac print is my weakness. So I've always wanted this shirt. It was like one of those things that's like, I before I die, I will have this shirt, we'll keep it, we'll pass it on to my children. So a dream come true, in my opinion, that I bought this for myself and I can't believe I own it. And I just love it. It's just like perfect to me. It's absolutely perfect to me. Probably this is like probably my most valuable piece of clothing I own, I think. But yeah, I, I just love it so much. This is a tank top that I thrifted. It is like this, I don't, uh, what do they call it? Point, point at, I don't know what they call this like stitching. But um, this is like a, I'm pretty sure this is like a true vintage top. Like this is giving me vintage vibes. But um, 
it's just beautiful and I I love this like just simple white like lacy look. It reminds me of like pretties type of stuff and I really want something from them. So this is my Unif Wink skirt. I love it obviously just because it's really cute, but uh, Unif was like one of my favorite brands for a really long time. If you go back to my if you go to my old videos, like one of my first videos I made was like a Unif collection. And I had so much Unif stuff, like, n like it's like, it was like a ridiculous amount. I was like a collector at that point. But since then, I've actually sold a lot of my Unif stuff just because I don't really wear it anymore. But I don't know, I think that was like a huge part of my life. <laughs> I'm just like stupidly sentimental about a lot of dumb things. But this is just like symbolic of that kind of love for that brand. I still love that brand. It's my favorite piece from them, I think. Um, the wink skirt, this color combination is like the best, my favorite. And I remember getting this from my grandma for my graduation. So yeah, this was very sentimental to me. This is my favorite flannel. I don't have much of a story. It's just like, I reach for this probably two out of the seven days every week. Um, it's just comfortable. I love these colors. Like I love blue and green together and it's just the perfect flannel in my opinion, and I love it so much. If I don't know what to wear, I'll wear this with a t-shirt and jeans every day. This dress, this is a Betsy Johnson dress. Once again, it has, I love it so much because of like the beading on the top and the bottom, and then like this beautiful pink stitching. But um, this is definitely one of my favorite pieces that I own, one of my favorite dresses. Um, I wore this on my 21st birthday, so it's special for that reason as well. But I love Betsy Johnson. Like, vintage Betsy Johnson is, like, top tier, in my opinion. I love it. It was just, like, meant for me. It fits me so nicely, and I just love it so much. And it's very, very special to me. This is my favorite sweater. I love thrifting sweaters, vintage sweaters. They're just, like... The best i love winter for that reason because i can wear my big sweaters my favorite one it's green and it has also a lot of colors in it that's just very flattering on me this one is like amazing with jeans with skirts it's just my favorite go-to sweater um it's by this brand but i just adore this so much and i wear it all the time and i love it and i'll always have it this is a hysteric glamour t-shirt Hysteric Glamour quickly became one of my favorite brands just because I love the like sexy lady designs on it. Like, beginning of quarantine, I kind of found out about Hysteric Glamour. I'm not really sure how, but I did and I was like obsessed. So this was the very first Hysteric Glamour piece I ever bought. I love the like fit of it. I can't even explain it. Like with certain t-shirts, the fabric is so thick that like it's stiff and like not loose. This is a very loose t-shirt. It kind of feels like a vintage t-shirt vibe. Um, I love the design. And then on the back it says, keep yourself alive. This is definitely my most worn Hysteric Glamour piece. I have a few, but this is my most worn one, my favorite one, my first one. So it's very special for a lot of different reasons. And I'll always have it. It's just like the best and I love it so much. This piece is my um, Winnie the Pooh varsity jacket. I guess that's what they're called. I wanted a jacket so bad that had the cream sleeves with like the denim. I wanted, that's like exactly what I wanted. So I was looking for it on Depop for a really long time, could never find anything. And then I found this jacket for not even that expensive. And I was like, okay, I'm gonna buy it. And I love it. I wear it so much. It's such like a unique piece in my opinion for a jacket. Like I love wearing this. I get so many compliments too every time I wear it. It's like just one of those things that I wanted so badly and um, I got exactly what I wanted. So that is very special. And the last piece I'm going to show you guys is this jacket. This is my favorite jacket ever. I can't wait until I have like a son or a daughter and they like wear this jacket. I don't know. It's a vintage Charlotte Russe jacket. It is the perfect Penny Lane jacket in my opinion. Um, it has like the fluffy sleeves and the collar and it's like a suede material. I just love this and it fits me perfectly. It's very flattering and I don't know. I just, I love it. 
I absolutely, it's like glamorous and gorgeous and like you can wear it casually, you can wear it like dressed up. It's just amazing. Every like special event, I'll wear this jacket and feel like a literal celebrity. So yeah, those are all of my like prized pieces, my favorite pieces ever. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, let me know actually your guys' most prized possession or favorite piece ever and why. I'd love to know. I think that stuff is so interesting. Um, but yeah, I love you guys so much and I will see you guys in the next video. Mwah. Bye guys.